Hello people, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to talk about the molecular dynamics simulation, how to perform molecular dynamics simulation in Siesta. And uh, also in my all previous videos, uh, as you have seen that I have mentioned many Siesta algorithms as well as uh, how to deal with Siesta program that I have mentioned. And also I have done some transport calculations as well. So uh, today uh, my topic would be based upon molecular dynamic simulation and uh, some of the theoretical concepts that uh, MD simulation performs. So whether you perform the classical dynamics or uh, maybe <coughs> TFT based uh, dynamics, uh, always it follows one uh, approximation that is called Born-Oppenheimer dynamics in which you consider nuclei. Are much slower than the electrons and uh, we need to extract the information from the potential energy surfaces we need to find the local versus global minimum we move over the potential energy surfaces and good sampling is required for the molecular dynamic simulations and it also follows the time evolution of a system solves the Newton's equations of motion treats in DFT MD, it treats electrons quantum mechanically, and uh, and uh, allows uh, us to study all the dynamic processes, annealing of the complex materials, the influence of temperature, the influence of pressure, and uh, so many parameters. Uh, you know, influence the molecular dynamic simulations. So there are, um, I'm going to mention you about the how many type of algorithms is in Siesta program. <coughs> there are, I think, I guess, uh, Wurlitt algorithm is there, um, which is based upon uh, NVE, microcanonical assembles. Uh, another one is the NOS, NVT canonical, and NPE, Perinello Rahman algorithm and nose paternal Riemann algorithm NPT so NVE NVT NPE and NPT those four types of uh, algorithms are present in and also anil anilling options is also there so in siesta you have all these uh, algorithms and i'm going to <coughs> i mean if you run with the wallet it performs nve ensemble dynamics if you perform with the nose it uh, uh, performs NVT dynamics with nose thermostat, I mean temperature based, I guess. And uh, if you perform with Perin Perinello Raman, then uh, I guess it pressure PR barostat. Uh, it performs the dynamics with the PR barostat. And nose Perinello Raman with thermostat and barostat. And anil with specific, uh, you know, pressure as well as that temperature. So these type of algorithms are there and I'm going to show you how to create the FTF file, you know, input file for the molecular dynamics run. And uh, also I'm going to show some of the outputs that I got from, uh, you know, a simple unit cell calculations that I'm going to show. So let's get started and thanks. And also do subscribe my channel and like my video, share, comment and uh, also mention that what other videos do you like to do you like me to make a uh, tutorial on thank you so let's get started i recommend everyone to read the siesta 4.0 or 4.1 manual for the molecular dynamic simulation in siesta because all the options have been described well in the siesta manual and uh, and here are the list of the algorithms that are present in Siesta module. Like uh, if you run for the Verlet, uh, it is a standard Verlet algorithm in, in molecular dynamics. And uh, another option is the nose MD with temperature controlled by means of a nose thermostat. Perinello Raman MD with the pressure controlled by the Perinello Raman method. Nose Perinello Raman meta, um, MD uh, is with the temperature which is controlled by the nose thermostat, this algorithm, and the pressure controlled by the Perinello Raman method. And anil is another option with a specified you know, desired temperature or the pressure. 
and these are the five algorithms which you can perform the molecular dynamics in siesta program and uh, i'm going to show you uh, also what are the options that is uh, available and i highly recommend everyone to read the siesta manual before jumping into molecular dynamic simulations so i'm going to show you some of the options which are uh, used for uh, you know uh, simulation parameters suppose for example the tag that you won't need to specify for the molecular dynamics starts with MD and dot and uh, rest of the parameters so one by one I'm going to show you what are the parameters that you can describe in your input file uh, while calculating you know siesta so number one is the initial time step which could be you know the default value is one the initial time step would be you know the first time step would be one and the md dot final time step would be you know if you need a longer time simulations then you can mention something around 5000 or you know thousand or something whatever it depends upon the specific requirements suppose for thousand final step so another one is MD dot length uh, time step which is really important because uh, it generates uh, the coordinates or the velocities it calculates all the MD simulation uh, you know uh, the dynamics uh, and uh, the length of the time step of all the MD simulations. So generally, people recommend to use as recommended by you know Siesta manual is uh, uh, 1.0 FS. So <clears throat> you can choose whatever you want. It depends upon the desired specific parameters. And uh, another option is the MD initial temperature and you can specify the room temperatures like 298 Kelvin and these this initial temperature uh, tag can be used with uh, Verlet, nose parallel or Raman, nose parallel Raman and Anil. I mean all the options you can specify the initial uh, temperature and these three options you can specify in all the algorithms as well and uh, and the next option would be md dot target temperature that um, if you need something to be calculated from the room temperature until you know 600 kelvin so you can mention that you can mention that and this option can only be used with the nose Parnell or Raman I'm sorry uh, nose nose Parallel or Raman and Anil only this option can be used only with Anil nose Parallel or Raman and nose MD not with Parallel or Raman because it is the pressure controlled by this uh, algorithm so this temperature in target temperature options should be used with anil nose parallel Raman and nose MD, not even with burlet and uh, <clears throat> another option is uh, uh, is called MD tau relax so this option is only used when you use the anil uh, you know MD option uh, MD type of run because here you have to specify MD dot type of run I'll make it you know, type of run and then you mention all the algorithms suppose if you are using verlet use verlet or if you are using nose then use nose if you are using Anil, then you use Anil like that. This is the desired options out of all these five algorithms. You can specify the MD type of run, 
and MD tau relax can only be used when using the anil MD type of rod and uh, <clears throat> okay and the next would be Uh, MD tau relax the default value is uh, you know 100 FS and you can mention uh, you know whatever the desired parameters that you need to uh, you know to perform and uh, this this option also uh, performs the the target temperature or pressure achieved by the velocity and the unit cell rescaling in a given time determined by this MD tau relax so and th this this option is basically uh, the relaxation time to reach the target temperature and pressure in uh, while using this anil uh, MD so this is a relaxation time given to acquire a specific desired temperature or the pressure at a given time so this option uh, you need to be careful about this option and uh, use it while using the anil option over here next if you want to you know calculate the md bulk modulus md md uh, bulk modulus uh, you have to Again, this option can only be used when you are using the annual option for the desired temperature and uh, pressure. So, while using these two tags, you have to mention another tag which is called MD dot annual option, and you need to specify pressure and temperature. Oh, sorry, uh, it should be the other way around temperature and pressure. This option has to uh, must be used while using the anil option. So I'm going to write it again. So MD type of run would be anil, and you can specify this option. These are the optional, you know, option MD bulk modulus which is the default value default value is uh, I think around 100 uh, 0.0 reach per constant um, U H R star star 3 yeah this is the you know the default options and uh, uh, yes and the anil option can be used for the temperature and pressure the desired temperature and pressure you can either choose temperature or pressure or maybe both and then you have to mention and in between that Sorry. temperature and pressure so these are these four are the optional parameters for the annual option you can use it you know according to your choice and uh, regarding the uh, uh, writing parameters I can show you some of the FDA files that I have created uh, for different types of run suppose for the anil option I have created this FDF file which you have system name system level what do you want to level number of species number of atoms chemical species block lattice constants lattice vectors atomic coordinates mon cost pack mesh cutoff basis type, basis size, energy shift, functionals, authors, how many iterations do you require, solution method and user basis is used when you use the ion files and uh, these are some of the optional parameters according to your you know defined choice the solution method should be diagon electronic temperature you can mention whatever you need I mean it depends and this option is important uh, because it can write the MD history files uh, in the uh, in the format called uh, MD car, and you have all your history of coordinates, how it's changing, you know, the coordinates, how it you know 
changing like uh, suppose you see this is the initial coordinate and while you go for uh, the second step it changes the coordinate so it is required and also another one it also produces the MD file which I'm going to tell you uh, later <coughs> so the option would be MD type of run, il, uh, run is anil anil options are uh, temperature and pressure, initial temperature this much, target temperature this much, target pressure also you can mention, length time step, tau relax and final uh, time step, how, how many steps do you require. So this option can be you know uh, used for uh, um, that I have shown previously. So this is for the anneal option and now I'm going to show you for the nose thermostat, sorry nose uh, which in which until here everything is same and here what you is you define the type of run as nose initial temperature is given target temperature is also given initial time step final time steps and then and the length time step you mentioned for the nose and for the NPR nose parallel no Raman uh, I think where is that Yeah, so FDF file in which you mention the type of run as nose parallel or Raman target pressure and target temperature because you in this algorithm you have the pressure and temperature uh, temperature control and initial temperature time step length time step and final time step. So this is the nose parallel or Raman option. And this is the Palen Raman option in which you have uh, MD type of run as Palen Raman, target pressure, initial time step. You don't have to mention the temperature because it doesn't perform, you know, the temperature dependent calculations MD. So only you have to uh, mention the target pressure for the Palen Raman. And now for Verlet algorithm, it's really, you know, this is the simple algorithm and you have the options like type of run should be Verlet, initial temperature is 600 K or you mentioned whatever you want. initial time step this much, final time span length time step. So this is the way how you can, you know, create the input file for different algorithms. For the five algorithms that I have mentioned, Verlet, Nose, Palin, Raman, Nose, Palin, Raman, and Anil options. So, and uh, I'm going to show you one output that I got from I think Anil options, in which what are the outputs that can be produced in MD. So when you uh, do a calculations, I did it for I did a small calculations for the unit cell uh, until ten time steps. So the uh, most important file that you get uh, over here is uh, ANI, ANI file, animation file, uh, the MDE file, the MD car file, and uh, the structure uh, iteration file, eigenvalues file, and XV file where you store all the coordinates. And the most important file is ANI or MD and then MDE file. So in MDE file when you open it so you have as you have mentioned in the you know diff, uh, in the input uh, regarding all the parameters that you need uh, for your calculations. So the first will be the steps mentioned over here. I prefer uh, a small calculations in which I have done only for 10 steps. This is the temperature block. This is the cone sham energy. This is the total energy, this block, and this is uh, the uh, volume, and this is the pressure. So, so this is the way how, and also you can use GNU plot to, you know, plot each and everything. As uh, x coordinate would be ten steps, and the temperature, uh, cone sham energy, e total energy, volume, and pressure would be, you know, the y coordinates. As you can mention so I have prepared uh, out of all the algorithms when I have done the calculations for the 
10 time steps I get different uh, you know outputs and this is for the anneal this is for the nose thermostat and this is for the nose paleno Raman step okay and this is for the paleno Raman in which the temperature doesn't matter but the pressure changes in which the pressure is mainly controlled here both temperature and the pressure both control and in the wallet algorithm and the initial temperature I have mentioned is 600 K and it starts from here and you can see different all, all the parameters that you require uh, for your calculations so uh, and uh, uh, one important thing is you have to mention the time step to be you know longer period so that you can see uh, some of the you know outputs and I'm going to uh, get one output uh, from this calculations by using this uh, algorithm uh, sorry uh, this uh, utilities from the CS star which is called AXSF which you can visualize how the uh, you know how the simulation has been performed and for that what you need to do is dot slash md to asxf just uh, type enter and you have to specify what uh, is the name system level that you have given so in my case I have given anneal so it has four atoms and suffix of the molecular dynamics file in which file do you want uh, to visualize the dynamics so uh, suppose I suppose use ANI file animation file and you have to specify three numbers for the first step last step and how, how uh, and how many steps interval you can you need to make your movie so in my case is one comma ten and I need it like a one time step interval so do you want to define output box? So I make it no. So you have your file called anil.asxf file. And since I have the crystal maker program, which is commercial and can be obtained by <clears throat> spending $80, I guess. And this is really good software. So when you open it, uh, you have uh, your output ASXF file and also you can open it with uh, xkristen but uh, xkristen animation is good but uh, the uh, it is not uh, good for the publication quality I guess it is only to visualize the output so this program is really good when you see like this and when you open the ASXF file in uh, crystal maker just press the button play and you see how the you know the dynamics is uh, going on. this is only at a short time interval only 10 steps so if you do it for thousand or five thousand or ten thousand steps it will you will see the uh, actual animation how it looks so this is the way you can you know predict the output and uh, you can visualize the output by using you know whatever the software you like but I like crystal maker because it is commercial and uh, it is uh, well represented and used for publication quality figures so this is uh, all about the you know uh, MD simulation and the most important file again I'm going to tell you is the MDE file in which you can plot the steps temperature consumption energy total energy volume and pressure that's it and uh, in the next tutorial uh, this is about the DFT MD simulation. In the next tutorial, I'm going to uh, tell you about the classical MD simulations by using Gromax. Thanks.